Hey, let's start this morning with something that is special. It tends to happen only once. Big radio farewell yesterday with an unexpected twist. After 30 years together, K-Rock's morning team, Kevin and Bean, broadcast their last show together. Uh, there's Kevin. You're seeing the clip. You don't see Kevin when we're joining the show. There's Kevin there with Doug. Kevin remains, excuse me, that was Bean. Bean is the taller one. Okay. Kevin stays, Bean is bailed. Yesterday was better for him. Yes. Plan to move to England. There are several members of the radio family, including Alan McKay, who will remain with Kevin in the show. On the Goodbye broadcast yesterday, an unexpected guest, 26 years ago, another K-Rock sidekick, poor man, pulled a prank. He invited 500 K-Rock listeners to Bean's house in Hancock Park. Uh, yeah. Hilarious. Unless you were Bean himself, yeah. Right. Yeah. who had Poor Man fired. Oh, poor good. Man was replaced by Adam Carolla. Oh. Adam and Jimmy Kimmel were in studio yesterday, and who pops up on the phone? Oh. The Poor Man. Oh. Hey, Kevin and Bean, it's the first time I've been on K-Rock in 26 years. 26 we years. We, you know we got Jimmy Kimmel here and Adam Carolla as well. Adam Carolla, the man who had you fired so he could steal your radio show. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, thank, thanks a lot, Adam. You owe your whole career to Love Line and my show, damn it. Yeah. Thank you for censoring yourself there. Now, let's <laughs> it. Here's the thing, okay, and I agree. I should not have taken 500 listeners there, and I lost 180 grand a year in salary. And uh, and my gig at K Rock, which is you know, in the end, you got to think that was pretty stupid of me, right? Right. But but poor man, uh, d just for context here, weren't you fired at Kiss FM? Weren't you fired at Star ninety eight point seven? Weren't you fired at Tour uh, Power one hundred six? Like almost every radio station you've ever worked at, you've been fired for doing something dumb. I mean, you kind of have a history of making poor choices. Uh, well, name. <laughs> <laughs> also, poor man, you got a buck eighty. They started at sixty five. <laughs> <laughs> on the phone, Ad Adam. Adam, you've always been terrible in comedy. I must tell you. I know. Yes. I know. That's why I'm coming on thirty years because that's how it works. <laughs> yeah, poor man, are, are, you, are, you, are you so annoying it could shatter glass? But other than that, no, you're that's a good one. Apparently, got uh, very got awkward at certain parts.